Hey, what's up, you total solar eclipses, and welcome to the Deck Build Challenge, where each week two or more combatants face off with strange theme decks. I'm your host, Hardleg Joe. Joining me, four combatants, most of which are new. On first up, on team one, we have Bambi. Hello. Who is not the deer, right? Not yet. Not yet. He's working on it. Next up, we have Storm of Script, kind of an unusual name. Uh, yeah, you know, I've had it for a while. Howdy ho, audience. I'm just here to, you know, be filler. You know how it goes. Huzzah. After that, we've got returning Harcyon of Harcyon Gaming. I am not in my car this time, but I did buy new shoes. All is well. And finally, the humble cucumber. Hey, everyone. How's it going? Yeah, you know, he, he's down-to-earth guy. He grows out of the earth like an actual cucumber. Absolutely. You'd love it down there. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this week, we this is another... a. Uh, uh, this week we have the results of another Patreon tournament. This time we had a tag tournament, and it was all chaos. So uh, all the patrons got up in groups of two, teams of two, and one team is playing nothing but light monsters, and one team is nothing but dark monsters. And we forbid all archetypes, so it's generic light and dark. Uh, although we made an exception for Black Luster Soldier, because he's like the patron saint of chaos, we have to have him in there. So they can have Black Luster Soldier, it's generic, one one tag partner has light, one has dark. It's kind of a complex theme, but it worked out pretty interesting, I think. I don't know, once again I didn't watch many of the duels. I was too busy basically perusing around everyone and trying to make sure everyone was happy. I've heard that there are a lot of counter fairies involved. Yes. <laughs> I don't know what makes you think that. Actually, I do, because, what was it, I, there were a couple that went into time, and I know, like, uh, I can't remember, because it's been a few weeks now, because I record these in bunches, but I thought that mm. there was, like, there, like, I, I seem to remember someone playing nothing but normal monsters, and there was one guy who I was running, like, his, his partner was running all traps, and he was running all monsters. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. Hey, Double Pot of Desires, and the Fairy Tale. Ooh. You have no idea what I drew off Desires, Joe. Why would you set that? You could do more damage attacking it. Is that a, is that a thing? Of honest? To be honest. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot about honest. I don't know, I, I, I feel like if your partner has dark monsters and you're only going to be on the field half the time, Honest isn't probably the best choice. Honest has worked for me so far. Yeah, Honest has won me games. Gilgarth? <laughs> He's the Gilius of the Garths. The steel-armored terror machine ruthlessly <laughs> strikes down enemies with its giant katana. Um, excuse me, that's clearly not a katana, it's more of a scimitar. I didn't know we were supposed to go that generic. <laughs> <laughs> La Jin, the mystical genie of the lamp. A genie of the lamp that is at the beck and call of its master. Mechanical chaser! <laughs> so what is this, all normal dark monsters? I don't know what makes you think that. A hunter that relentlessly pursues its target by order of the Machine King. White ele... <laughs> Well, this is <laughs> discount third... draw city. Self mill the darkness. deck. You're just making me read all of these, aren't you? Dark Blade. Oh. They say he is a dragon manipulating warrior from Dark World. His attack is tremendous, using his great swords with vicious power. I waited very patiently to even finish that for the next summon. The next summon. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Chaos sorcerer. <laughs> well, why? No. Oh, that's one way to get rid of fairy tale snow. That was my only one. <laughs> <laughs> that was the entire strategy for my deck. Just make fairy tale snow over and over again. I was just playing one fairy tale snow in a sixty card deck, and it, that was my whole strategy. Is that you, Bell? Do we got do we got you, mm. Bells, over here? 
Some people in the comments are going to be happy. Comment in the comments if you, you are a big fan of you, Bell. I'm a big fan of you, Bell. She's sort of like a he-she kind of thing, but then she turns into a double-headed dragon. And then, then I think a three-headed dragon. Is it a three-headed dragon? Isn't I the forget. third one a three-headed dragon? I never looked what at it. Plural amount of heads. Oh no, Mystic Tomato. I think the final form has a head on the like chest or something. Haha! -ha! So it's reviewing life. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't you at least steal its attack? It's permanent. Quick, bitch! <laughs> Dang it! Get rid it's of it. it! It's okay. Well. Oh, got Mystic Tomato on the graveyard. Smart, smart man. He said, "Oh yeah, all the all the materials are in the graveyard now. I guess if that's what you wanted, do that. I needed to find a way to get them both there. <laughs> that's that card. I love it. Oh, Aww. return, escape from the dark dimension. But now it doesn't have material. And now you're right, right? <laughs> Actually, you know what?" Thanks. Does this work? Can you tribute? No, it doesn't, because he still has Swords of Revealing Light. <laughs> <laughs> Swords of Revealing Light, too meta. strong. It's meta for deck build challenges everywhere. I didn't even run Warboku this time, Joe. <laughs> Did anyone run, um, what was it, uh, Moon Mirror Shield? Yes. Oh, okay. People We've keep... Had, uh, more Oh, uh, cut out there. Sorry. No, go ahead. Repeat yourself. I didn't hear it. Come along, like Moon Mirror Shield beatdown going on. <laughs> yeah, I, I I consistently have people say that I need to to ban that from uh from the deck build challenges. But it, I'm just using it as a one of. Because they're like, not even they're like with, with, they're like without Raigeki and Dark. I think we allowed Dark Holes, didn't we? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, speak it up. Well, there you go. Yeah, they're like without right no. geckies and stuff. Like, what what chance do we have against Moon Mirror Shield? My like, Marshmallow. You, you know what really counts, Moon Mirror Shield? Swords revealing light. <laughs> <laughs> How are they gonna attack you when they can't even attack? Ooh, ties of the Tiger Brethren. Look at all those katanas they have. <laughs> Oh, actually, the skimmer towers. Ooh, I thought they were supposed to be goblin attack force. Guiding Ariande Grodne. I don't think they're goblin. Are they goblins? They I have no look, clue. Maybe they always reminded well, like, me of the Puma men, men from Action Fifty Two. I think they were called the Puma Men. <laughs> no, the Cheetah the Men. Cheetah Men. No, the Puma Man is from a uh, fucking Mystery Science Theater Three Thousand. That's like one of the best episodes, too. I'd highly recommend it. Vorse Raider. This wicked beast warrior does every horrid thing imaginable and loves it. probably kill the Artemis. His axe bears the mark of his yeah. countless victims. Why didn't you kill the Artemis? Good. It's not... <laughs> he did kill the Artemis. Curse is spoiled again. The Apollo. He does every horrible thing and enjoys it. I don't know, that every horrible thing? I could think of some pretty horrible things. He makes parody videos of anime on the, the internet. <gasps> he dubs his own Naruto abridged. <laughs> <laughs> and he loves it. <laughs> he puts Pepsi in a Coke glass. <laughs> <laughs> No, if, if so, Force uh, Raider made an abridged series, it would be the Bleach abridged from Naruto abridged. <laughs> Yo, Bam, you want to activate that other card I set? That'd be great. Not yet. Hello, my name is Ichigo. I am a Soul Reaper. Now let me introduce to the 400 other characters in this game show. Bleach started out really promising. And then somewhere along the line, it's like the main character just kind of disappeared. No, Bleach's problem was they decided that instead of waiting, instead of, like, filling out what they should have done, like Dragon Ball did, to catch up, 
they decided to just stop the story and insert entire filler arcs that had no actual substance. I mean, they'd done that with other things before, like Naruto survived, it's like 500 plus episodes of filler. No, like, they didn't just stop in the middle of the arc and go to an entire different series of filler. They, like, slowed down the pace of the series in general. They didn't, like, add new episodes that you just skip. Oh, okay. No, Bleach would literally be, like, in the middle of an arc that was like, holy crap, everyone's dying, we need to save Rookie or whatever. And then the next episode would be like, hey, this little girl wants to play soccer, let's go help her. And it's 20 <laughs> episodes of that. I was just saying, <laughs> like re- remember Ichigo's sisters? Well, they're doing stuff on Earth, and it's wacky. I hope you enjoy. What the what fuck? The... <laughs> Golden homunculus. Well, that's attack. You know, let's just not allow that type of attack this turn. <laughs> Edward Elric would be terrified. He don't want anything to do with homunculi. No, no, no. You no attacking me today. Uh... Don't go and get over that. I like, is he made out of rocks? He looks like he's made out of rocks, but he's a warrior. Uh, he's probably made out of the Philosopher's Stone. Probably. Now yeah, I'm, you should activate that card. I'm no Yu-Gi-Oh expert, but if I was you... <laughs> <laughs> Dang, Nabbit. This game sucks. <laughs> if I was you, I would turn Vorse Raider into defense mode. Or not. Why does he need that when he has swords of revealing light? Because that can be twin twistered. <laughs> I refuse to accept that reality. <laughs> that can't happen. That's impossible. But yeah, you're right. Heavy desires. storm duster. <laughs> Is that what it's called? I keep forgetting. I got its name confused. Yeah, that's uh, what it destroys too, right? It's a twin twister, but slower. It's either heavy storm duster or heavy dust stormer. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. It's heavy bowling ball season. Can we get that put up on the screen, Joe? No. No, why are you gonna make me do work? Also, is it just, does Vorse Raider have legs? Yeah, you can see his foot in the picture. Like a little brown foot. Look closely, Joe. Come on now. Um, they have the card art they made for us. I'm, I'm looking pretty closely, but it just looks like his... Like, unless the, the, uh, the, the perspective is just way off and he's, like, leaping towards the screen. I'm gonna do something risky. No, I think he just has, like, baby feet. <laughs> baby okay, feet. I'm, this I'm, works. Proud this, I'm proud of this call. Why did... Oh, shoot. It's gonna be too late, monsters. Never mind. This is a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Brings Honest back to hand. Go ahead and attack the Dark Vorse Raider if you dare. Knowing there's an honest out there. Or you could just leave it out there, play the mind games. It's like I did my mind games deck. It's like you put out a Kalut, then they know you're playing Kalut. They wouldn't dare attack into that, because what if they get hit by Kalut? Exactly. The other honest must be in his hand. Exactly. Why else would he just leave it out there? I'm just going to bring this back. Just don't run out of time. Yes, that was wrong. But yeah, people will have to comment in the comments with what they thought about Bleach. I'm oh, into, sure, why not? Get out of here. Oh, Donna. snap. Ultimate Providence. Well, that's hey! unfortunate. <laughs> See, he's a smart one. Bambi knows what's up. I think that right. was, was that Bambi or was that Harcyon? Is that turned in defense mode? Yeah. Harcyon's Bambi. the one with the golden homunculus. Okay. I thought so, but I always get confused on these tag duels. Plus, I'm fiddling with a pen while I'm doing stuff, and I got distracted. I really, I really need a fidget spinner. I think. Do you, do you, do you want an apple? A, an apple? Yeah. She no. Got a pen. Oh, the app. Oh, oh, oh! It's the memes, is it? And, oh, hey, more stuff for me to read. Mad Dog of Darkness. He used to be a normal dog who played around in the park, but was corrupted by the power of darkness! I wonder what I darkness is... just came to a park. Bambi, I'm... I really don't have a lot of options here, I'm sorry. Just I go into crazy dogs. Just go into crazy dogs. 
<laughs> oh, it's time to get crazy now, is it? Come on, five or four. Show me Six. potato salad. Five. Time to roll those bones. Four. four. Oh, let's get rid of that. <laughs> no. It's only until the end of the turn, though. You still so. can't attack it. Yeah, you can't attack it. <laughs> so you can't attack with crazy bones. What's going to do? <laughs> um, hmm. Can I? No, I can't do that. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> hmm. You wouldn't dare sacrifice your golden homunculus. And it's back. And, it, uh, and it's back. And soon it'll permitted. be able to attack that crazy box, and that doesn't have enough attack. <laughs> Activate my third source of revealing light. I just like, I'm, <laughs> like, oh, I'm going to play this burden of the mighty. That'll slow them down. And like, Bitch, <laughs> I don't even feel that. I mean, technically they could be playing six swords of revealing Come light. Come on. Five. 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 And five. Five. And three swordsmen of revealing light. If you light. want to negate the effect, you have to do it before he rolls. No. What? Um, well. <laughs> great. <laughs> Wait, you Let's... can activate the think thing. The fact thing. Yeah, I could do that. Like, it wouldn't. Still defense. We're going to lose if we don't. <laughs> I know. Um... Oh, that's actually a different card. You'd be better in attack. Not, you can do Not really. I, I yeah, could he, avoid 1200 damage. You could have done 14. Like this way, now he yeah. could. Like, now Bountiful Artemis can kill him, and then he could just attack for 72. Yeah. Let's just it appreciate matter. how much damage yeah. I just did, uh, you know, while I was in control there. <laughs> Pressing no was a really good option. Magic cylinder. Dimension walk, please. You wouldn't dare attack directly with 7200. He's got to test out the waters with Shining Angel first. He doesn't want to get hit by that Gores. <laughs> no Gores for you. Gores can't even activate right now. I like to pretend, all right. <laughs> one of the one of the cards, one of the face downs, well, is malevolent catastrophe. So he clears his field, so he could use Gores. Ah, that would have been a good one. I told you to do Dark Factory mass production. That would have been great. We could have got the defense mode. We would have been fine. Sadly, Crazy Box doesn't quite... That effect really kind of ruined things for him. Yes. You would have had a couple more turns if you didn't have your life <laughs> But you did negate that effect for a hot minute. All right, so we'll, we'll let you guys... You, you can't do a match of tag duels, so we'll let these guys side yeah. the old-fashioned way, and then we'll be back. This channel is so interesting. <laughs> Not mine. There's a channel Which, I watch. It's just it's like the channel of this company that makes industrial shredders. <laughs> and it's like they just at once a month they're like, here's a video. Here's us throwing laptops into a shredder. <laughs> Ever want to see a machine that can reduce a laptop to dust? Now you can watch it. <laughs> like, well, ain't that interesting? Okay, we're back. We're back again, and this time we're definitely fighting. I am certain of it. I can see a screen. People are on that screen. Fists are being pumped. Now they're having a high five. <laughs> oh, no. Go team venture. Uh. That's what happens when you get the two scissors together. Wow. Just starting out with the pot of desires every time. It helped him last time. He got to his golden homunculus so fast no one even knew what was going on. Yeah, but my first one, I drew two desires off of the one desires. <laughs> Hopefully this one you banish all of them. Okay, this is not a great opening hand. Oh, fun. I mean, you have possibilities, unless you did that without any dark monsters. <laughs> um, I'm, uh, perhaps. Okay. I, I was wondering, did, it wouldn't, did, did it wouldn't be the first time. Did either of you guys have, like, the light player runs a lure of darkness and sets it for the dark player to use on their turn? Then you get six allure of darknesses. <laughs> I mean, my dark player's playing counter traps in case Ariadne gets blown up on his turn. Mystery Shell Dragon. Mysterious living matter that suddenly appeared from a different dimension. Its attack paralyzes the target's nerves and causes intense hallucinations. I never actually read that description. That's disturbing as fuck. A little bit. It's got spikes <laughs> it's everywhere. Not... 
It's not we need to bring dragon. that dragon to our next rave. <laughs> oops, 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 oops. It's like some kind of Lovecraftian horror. It's this weird thing, and I can't tell what's the front and what's the back, and if I touch it, I start hallucinating. <laughs> Someone make a movie about this thing. Either that uh, or... I don't know. I kind of imagine that, like, a ninja would kill this and then use it as a projectile weapon. See, so, yeah, I think they made that movie, Joe. I think it was called The Room. Oh, there are other fairy tales? My god. Yeah, I think there's, like, three, maybe? Whoa, one second. Someone got loud suddenly. We'll be right back. We're back! We're back, and all the noise has been, been uh... We're back! Go ahead and continue, guys. Oh, you can use the fairy tales to search the fairy tales. Oh no, don't banish your entire hand to summon fairy tale snow. Uh, she can only do that from the grave. Shh. Only tears. And then he has like three twin twisters, and he's like, well, I could use it if I had things, but... I don't okay. like all that back row. Yeah, Bob yeah. On the one hand, it's like they have all the back row, but on the other hand, you have a 2,000 attack point monster, they don't seem to be able to do anything about it. I mean, I have plenty of things to do about it. I just haven't decided if I want to do things about it. I could stop it if I wanted to. I just don't feel like it. Oh, guiding Ariande. Now, whatever you do, don't make crazy bombs. Okay. <laughs> well, I can't now. <laughs> just like, Thanks nope. For... It's just Chuck Testa. All right, you're about to see a no on your screen. <laughs> Choice, <laughs> no. The sun is a deadly laser. Well then. That worked better than I imagined. <laughs> Why? We can't have anything. <laughs> I couldn't even use that. Well, you can't, you can't set traps to turn you... you... <laughs> You're playing a risky game! Did, did, did oh both of you play Pot of Desires? Yeah. Ah, just getting the golden homunculus up to a million things? Yep. <clears throat> Absolutely. I assume you have Gren Maju Daiza in there somewhere, too. He is fire. Oh, he's fire. Oh. <laughs> I forgot about that. Eater of Millions is dark, though. Yeah, but he didn't gain that much attack. Isn't it only like 100 for every banished card? You're right. Yeah, but we have 21 right now. So we'd have 2,000 attack. 2,100, sorry. That would get over Mr. Spell Dragon. Yeah, but you could just <laughs> you could just play Cyber Dragon. Or Link, Link uh, Destroyer, whatever its name is. Ah, uh, but those wouldn't be allowed. Oh yeah, Cyber Dragon. Would, the other guy would, the Link guy. Uh, but he's Earth. Oh, is he? Yeah. You guys just want to ruin all my fun, don't you? <laughs> Making me look foolish on my own show. Yeah. And he's probably in beta. Uh, no. Why? Why you gotta be like this? No, no, no. Draws another swords. I've um, had some of the most funny interactions happen with Dark Bribe. I think it was, I was playing last week, and I like activated a. Uh, there, I was playing against counter fairies. And I activated terraforming, and they dark bribed it. I drew another terraforming. I activated it. They dark bribed it. And I drew another terraforming. <laughs> I was like, I'm getting that field spell. You can't stop me. Uh, can I use this on the right? Uh, of course. I said it for you. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> all you guys got to do is stall with all of your uh, swords revealing light, and you win. Oh, uh, they weren't. <laughs> Where's the marshmallow on? They'll deck out eventually. <laughs> I forget, are you the guys playing marshmallow glasses? No, no, that was the other team. Okay. I'm sad about this. <laughs> I remember I, I tuned into a duel because I was like, okay, it's going into overtime. What's taking so long? And I go in and they got a marshmallow with the marshmallow glasses. I I'm think like, that oh. was our duel, though. Oh, that's why. <laughs> I think they equipped it to our marshmallow, too. <laughs> You guys can only attack your own marshmallow. Does that work? I don't know. 
I don't think so. Pretty sure you can't attack your own monsters yet unless they make a new archetype. That'd be cool. Arm shield. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. But doesn't that change control out. of the monsters? Oh, hey, you still had that. Yes, I do. Um, I really wouldn't attack the Mystic to ban. Unless you have some way to banish it. You should definitely uh, attack the Mystic Tomato. You know, oh, well, I forget, that case. Did, didn't they just summon the uh, the Fairy Tail? Aren't they the light yeah. one? Yeah. Yeah. Which means if you kill it, there's no uh, dark monster for them to summon. Oh. You get it. Yeah. <laughs> no. <clears throat> and then spin it into the deck with Castell. You play Dark Castell, right? <laughs> <laughs> I have the light monsters. I really wish we could play Dark Mirror Force just because it says Dark in the name. Yeah, we always ban the Mirror Forces. Just because I feel like in, in these slower games, what if you get a Mirror Force, you're just done for. Except Dark Mirror Force is like the exception because it doesn't stop any attacks. Yeah. It only stops if they happen to have a monster in defense and an attack. Yeah. Remember Samurai, though? Yeah, Super yeah, Heavy dark. Samurai. Oh, yeah. hmm. Just or in case. Token. Or if you're playing digital bugs, and then, like, you wait for them to attack, and then you play zero gravity, and then activate. So all their monsters go to defense, and then get banished. It's like, cool, you'll take two damage. What? Oh, okay. Can I have my mystery shell dragon oh. back? I'm gonna get to him. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this card is mine now. Whatever, I'll just hold on to this, I guess. So what? What is Mystic Tomato gonna? Oh, oh, you Bell. Hey, we actually get to see you Bell summoned and not just discarded. And it's got big purpley wings. I never really watched. Oh, well, that was fast. <laughs> I assumed something more interesting than that would happen. <laughs> so you should have used Luna to get. Oh, that's why. Okay. Oh, okay. He's reversing your limits. And then they're gonna destroy that trap card. So, yeah. All right. Going to take it. Uh, yes or no? <laughs> oh, I, I would I would say yes. Yeah, you, you yeah. could you could negate the effect by sending a copy of Vorse Raider to the graveyard from your deck. Yeah. Luckily. No, no, no. And then kill it. I gotta say that swordsman of Landstar. What an ego maniac! He's got a shield with his face on it. Okay. Like it's one thing to have a coat of arms; it's another thing to have like a shield with your face on it. He's in the art of limit reverse, but Opticlops, a one-eyed giant that serves the dark ruler Hades, it skewers its enemies with its sharp horn, shattering them to pieces. Maybe I we have two options here. Which option do you want me to go for? Um, what are your options? I'm thinking Crazy Box or uh, Dark Chip, Black Chip of Corn. You should go for Rhapsody and Berserk. Go, go the Oh, if, it, if you get good. Black Ship of Corn, I'm pretty sure you could send you bell to the graveyard without destroying Don't it. Don't do that. Or do Black Ship of Corn. Graveyard, it's not destructive removal. Okay, yeah, do it. Corn! Gentlemen! I give you corn! And I'm just waiting for the Divine Wrath. Divine Wrath, maybe? Nah. Nope. I got nothing. <laughs> nah, dog. I ain't going out there. Now we to the battle phase for no reason. <laughs> yep, you can't attack. Yeah, good times. Good times. Yeah, and then next turn, and... this fairy tale is going to be like, you return to the hand unless you could send a black ship of corn from your main deck to the graveyard. <laughs> At least I'll go back to my hand. <laughs> no, oh, it's, wait, no uh, it's, it's main or extra deck. deck. Or okay. extra deck. Yeah, so if you've got extra. another copy of black ship of corn, you can save it. Not if I wait until the next next turn. True. And then I will have a black ship of corn. God damn. 
But unlike with the uh, the main deck monsters, where you're arguably helping them by filling up their graveyard, uh, they, they don't really have anything to benefit by putting a black ship of corn into the graveyard. Get a light monster in the graveyard. I have the perfect antithesis to black ship of corn. White ship of lettuce? Sky Pegasus! That's not the oh, opposite! <laughs> I wanted to see, like, the light submarine of just, cabbage or something like that. Just pay the thousand. <laughs> I don't know. We really, we lost a lot of life points last duel. No, pay the thousand. <laughs> comment, comment in the comments, what is the opposite of Black Ship of Corn? It's probably, like, the plane of, like, chocolate. <laughs> just unhealthy. But chocolate. <laughs> yeah, I guess... Too. I was thinking of other vegetables, but I guess, yeah, the opposite would be like... Or I guess if you want to go really opposite with food, it'd be like non-edible. So oh, it'd be like yeah. the white plane <laughs> of garbage. Well, its uh, evolved form would obviously be the popped ship of corn. I get it. I get it. It's not funny, but I get it. Um... Number C50. Popcorn ship. Burnt popcorn ship, maybe. Well, things to be... have been better to use that fact. Things seem to be go go going better for Team Bambi Bambi Storm. Storm Bambi. <laughs> wasn't wasn't that guy? Wasn't that your guys' name? I had all the teams select names. Yes. Yeah, that was our name from um back in the uh just one of the streams ah. for the Power Rangers game. Okay, good thing we saved that effect. Yeah, you can just... yeah, I can't use it this turn, though, because I do hurt an attack, so... Oh, sad <laughs> state of affairs. Hmm, so I was sitting there, I was like, I would have just taken the 2100 and then used it in the defense, or in the, the end phase. Now you in for some troubles, though. Because that'll, that'll nah. destroy it. Nothing happened. It's cool. Nothing happens? Oh, did you banish all the copies with... <laughs> <laughs> you might yes. have wanted to check that before you did defense mode. That might uh, have been no, no, one no, of no. those things you check. <laughs> Whatever, man. Oh, dark hole. <laughs> Fuck it. I'll just send everything to the graveyard. Go, go, Mystic Tomato. <laughs> Let's go. And card of demise. Jeez. We wanted to draw cards, Joe. <laughs> Clearly. We have two cards left. <laughs> I think we're gonna see a mill out. First uh, I'm just gonna tomato them to death. They don't take any we damage. <laughs> you chopped your cards with a uh, with a guillotine. Oh, there when it I was is. A kid, I thought Mystic Tomato looked too much like a pumpkin. <laughs> I guess it uh, it's I guess it kind of has three heads. It's got the chest head. I don't know. It just looks dumb. Yeah, Nickel Chaser. The second one, the second form is like intimidating looking. This one is just like, how how are you moving? How can you fly? You're just awkward. I think they're bringing out you, Bell, maybe. <laughs> nope. <laughs> it's a, it's a and and another weed. one. Attack of the Killer Tomato. These five normal monsters in my hand are not helping me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's what you get for running mostly normal monsters. It's like 12 cards! <laughs> also, does, does Me Mechanical Chaser just have a big big sword dong? <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. about that. Maybe that's me, I don't know. Oh no, I just- oh! Oh no! Oh, hey. It's that one guy that I was like, is the patron saint of the things, and now he's here. Doing the things! <laughs> I mean, you only have, you have very little fear with their face-down card. That Divine Wrath, though. Yeah, possibly. Potentially. I'm trying to figure out if I banished all my... homunculi. <laughs> There's so <laughs> many cards to look through. At this point, yeah, you're you're one guy. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That was like what an hour oh, ago. 
These tag duels, they take a long time. I should have brought a book. Uh, do we need this <laughs> card on the far right anymore? Uh, yes, we do, but if you need to get rid of it, go ahead. You don't You don't need if limit look, reverse, I'm pretty sure. The, uh, yeah, you can get rid of limit reverse, but if you look to the left of limit reverse, you'll see that little thing that we could do. It's and like a you... touring house. If you look to the left, uh, you'll see this lovely. But uh... it doesn't matter. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, but it's probably not going to happen anyway. So many banished cards, so little time. Take that, Mechanical Chaser. Instead of taking a crap ton of damage, you'll take very little damage. <laughs> it's not even light. <laughs> so unless you've got Dawnest... Or no, the... What was it? Black... The, the Dark Honest should be called Deception. <laughs> Best think... Mortal Kombat. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Mortal Kombat 2 is pretty good. Mortal Kombat 3 trilogy. I could really use a Dark Hole. Be pretty nice. Sexy, kind of. Be nice. Well then, looks like you got about one turn. Is your you hand said... all normal monsters too? No. Oh, okay. Cards from the sky. Which is like a lure really of the like darkness, but much more restrictive. Also, I don't Let's know, is that this. is that like a tower with tiny windows in it? <laughs> oh, <heck. laughs> wah, wah, wah. Except you can't attack this turn, and he's just going to banish you with Blackluster Soldier. Yeah. Oh. Not with this, all these set spell traps. <laughs> I am very scared. That could be, could be anything. Go ahead and activate your, your effect, Nub Lord, and then we'll see who's who. <coughs> you wouldn't dare activate your effect. <laughs> You'd be too oh. spooked. Yes! Oh, it is the Divine oh, Rack! <laughs> oh, snap! Oh, man, what will I do? Oh, no! <laughs> Wait, how are you going to attack over... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Effect Dang failure! It. He makes you his bitch, and then he just <laughs> summons Black Luster back. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, this that was just worth those in remotion. Uh, yeah. I'm in a glass cage of emotion. Hmm, what will I do? Can you activate it again, or is it one, or is it once per turn still in effect? Uh, no, it's not a hard one. Yeah, no, no, you're, it's gone. Ah, okay, no, okay. I'm, gl I'm glad to hear that. Uh, <laughs> it's still gone. Um, does he have enough? There's two, four, six. No, we're good. I think you I'm still survive. Yeah. Time for the comeback of the century. Yep, you're gonna you're gonna need a lot. I tell you what, but I believe seven hundred life points to get it's eleven thousand. You got this. I can finally, finally, we have light monsters in the graveyard. Yes. <laughs> Quick change. Oh, no. Hey, oh, what's up? Oh no, it's a tiny bush. <laughs> that, that's what I call Chaos Necromancer from now on. Do you have any bush. spell traps? No? Okay. I and really a Force Raider. Where's one of the Underdog when I need it? <laughs> or Foxy Bargain, that'd be great. Where's or... any of your spell traps when we need them? Dude, I don't know. I have running 12 monsters. I don't know how this happened. <laughs> Why didn't you kill my fairy tale? Because then you could I flip it face down. He'd rather banish it next turn. Shh. I don't. I feel like you didn't want to do that. Yeah, I did. Oh, okay. I was like, you probably want to make a rank four. It's probably your only chance to get over a chaos uh, necro facer. Oh, we just lost. Got another allure of darkness. Or uh, but effect veil. Vale. attack because you want the duel to go on. <laughs> Do we? Don't attack the Force Raider! Whatever you do, don't attack the Force Raider!
<laughs> That's unfortunate. Uh, I, I, I think it, you had a good shot, but unfortunately your normal deck didn't beat their draw everything and set a million traps deck. <laughs> Fine, you want me to? You want me to attack Force Raider? Go for it. Yeah. <laughs> Not opposed. Uh, I mean, he does enjoy doing everything terrible. I wouldn't feel bad about attacking him. Just whatever you do, don't flip K and throw her face down. Also, speaking speaking of, of Bleach, Paladynamo is like star Ichigo with that sword, am I right? <laughs> I want to I wanna see Bleach in space. Go. Hey, Rip man. us. Rip. A valiant fight, but the draw power was too strong. And uh, let me check the time real quick. Oh yeah, this is, uh, normally I would go into like pity duel territory, if, if we had one that just went, but it's already been uh, more than an hour. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I oh, mean, wow. some of that we'll have to cut out, but uh, I like the stuff in between and everything, but it's still been long enough. I don't think people need more action on this. Plus, I'm not sure what we would remove, maybe the fairy tales. Either way, it was it was an interesting thing. It's just a pity you didn't get to see the heart of the underdog draw a million cards. Or the Faustian Bargain. Love that card. Yeah, right. Faustian Bargain. I'm running, nightmare. like, 12 counter traps, and I or, got, like, two the whole game. Or Golden <laughs> Remunculus when we had that 48 cards banished. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, so you guys will have to comment in the comments. Would you like to see more themed tag duels, or do you prefer the more the more one-on-one -on -one stuff? Um... Because I was, I was still thinking, uh, doing the thing where, like, one, one teammate has all spells and one has all traps. Or maybe, like, one team, or one teammate is only allowed to have, like, tribute monsters. And then the other one has to find a way to get them tributed or something. I don't know. I think but, the spell trap one would be nice. Fine. I, I like the idea, just in general, of, like, ha having only one member, like, ha forcing you guys to work together, essentially. Yeah. Like, maybe one team has access to the extra deck. But the other team has tuners. Oh, that'd be neat. <laughs> one teammate only has tuners, the other one only has flip monsters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be weird. Anyway, is there uh Storm of Script? Any any last words? Um, no, not in particular. Uh Pot of Desire should be banned for all of eternity. But, you know. <laughs> and how Curse about you, Bambi? How how does it feel to lose on your first ever uh adventure? I, I, we did better than I thought we were going to do initially, so I'm happy. Yeah, I mean, you made it here, you beat all the other patrons. I didn't think we were going to make it here in general, so. Uh, Harcyon, how do you feel? Uh, kind of scummy, but I won, <laughs> so all I have to do is drink copious amounts of Coca-Cola life, and I'll be fine. Yay, Coca-Cola. And Cucumber, any, any last dirt words for us? Well, considering that we both built our decks in about 30 minutes and didn't test, uh, this went exactly how I thought it would. Yeah. You expected to win the entire time? <laughs> well, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Luck be a lady tonight. I mean, anyway, if you were sitting across the table <laughs> from a cucumber, I mean, would you even play the game? No, therefore the cucumber wins. <laughs> <laughs> there is logic in what he says. <laughs> I'm going to just take an actual cucumber to my next locals and sign it up. Good luck with that. Anyway, until <laughs> till next time, good luck. And have, have fun. fun. Okay, good. <laughs> it always takes a moment for the new people to realize they got to say